Hi, Aquarius. How are you doing? Um, <clears throat> I picked up the energy in today's reading. And I'm going to be squinting a little bit because it's super bright. But I need the light because it's always so dark. Bear with my eyes. My eyes are super sensitive. Um, so, I'm shuffling. And I got Cupid's arrow. Oh, son of a bitch. Okay. It's just that's going to be really loud. That's the most busiest part of the day. Okay. So, I came down with Cupid's arrow. So, have faith. Love is coming. Surprise invitation or meeting with hesitation. So, um... You know, that could be numerous things. So I pulled your energy in, or somebody's energy in, and it's lightning. So sudden change, shocking news, surprise, empathy, upheaval, transformation. So the thing is, is that there could be um, some type of hesitation, okay, with somebody. And this is why I say that. We've got the sword and the rose, the golden mirror the mirror and I like you so quite a lot of energy coming from this other person okay which is why there's hesitation obviously um, the thing is is what I got right away from these cards is there's there's kind of like somebody who thinks that they are a big deal okay and um, they might be a little self-absorbed and they might be, um, they might be a little narcissistic. Okay. So they have like a little, they're a little one-sided. Okay. Um, that's just obviously because maybe this person's been alone for a while and you know, being narcissistic when you're alone isn't the worst thing. I mean, you're supposed to be putting yourself first, you're supposed to be giving a crap about yourself. Right. So <clears throat> seems like that person's kind of like in that energy. And they kind of think that they're a big deal. And because they think that they're a big deal, there's hesitation between this exchange, okay, I want to say. So, um, like, it could even be universal, you know, like the universe could be like, listen, this person's not ready to meet you. You know, they still have to get over their ego. Okay, like, not everybody... For one, you know, there is no way that everybody knows who you are. Unless, you know, you're somebody like Brad Pitt watching me, okay? Nobody knows who you are. And <clears throat> second of all, not everybody's going to care. You know, not everybody's going to care about what you do. Not everybody's going to, you know, lay down a bed for you. <laughs> what do I want to say? Like, not everyone's, yeah, not everyone's just going to lay on coals for you to, like, walk on their back to get over, you know? Like, some people just aren't going to care maybe as much as what you think they're going to. So that's where it's, like, the ego has to come down, I think, a little bit with this person to be like, yo, hot shot. You know, like, and, like, I've worked for, like, people who have thought this, you know? Like, it's, it's, it's not like I'm, you know, talking, I feel like I'm talking to somebody that, that a lot of people would know famously. I'm just saying like a lot of people know a lot of people and and doesn't mean anything like they could think that they're okay I worked for this one chick <laughs> oh my god I worked at this um why can't I get the name it was like a pub I not really though not really a pub anyways it was a bar this is a basic bar but it had live entertainment every night so we had a band every single night and there was this manager and she was only the manager because she was banging the owner for like 10 years and he didn't know what she was gonna do so he just keeps her around so she doesn't sue him anyway she's in charge of payroll and she is a loser she thinks that servers make too much money and like at that place we were making like like two grand a week and she didn't like that and so she would cut our hours and she would like just not put our hours on our paycheck and stuff. And, and I, I remember looking at her one day, she had fake boobs and she was this like little tiny woman, you know, like she was like 
fucking 110 pounds. She was like a little chihuahua with these big, huge boobs. And she's like fucking 55 years old. She had a 25-year-old kid. Like, just won't go home and go to bed. Just won't. And so she, I remember her walking in one day and I was like, Tina, like you kind of look like you're a rock star because the way she, she was wearing this like low cut shirt and she had her fucking leather boots on. And she's like, I am a rock star. And I was like, no, you're not. And the fact that you think you are because you know, bands, it, it makes you nothing. Like, I couldn't believe that she had actually turned around. I thought she was just kind of taking it as, like, a compliment and just kind of, like, laugh. And she was like, I am a rock star. And I'm like, <laughs> okay. Like, people, some people are very self absorbed okay? But they like you. So it might be shocking. This news might be shocking because you might think, like, you know, this person's too, maybe too good for you, or you're like, really, you like me? <laughs> you know, but opposites attract. All right, let's see what this self-absorbed, slightly narcissistic, introspective person want to say to this Aquarius here. Oh, there's something flipped. What's the... Okay, bottom of the deck has a lot to say. What are we at? Seven minutes. Oh, geez, this is going to be a long one. Um, okay, so first of all, we have the fool with strength. So this person's like, listen, there's this new beginning coming. So be strong. Stay strong. Okay. Stay strong. <laughs> okay. So eight of swords, seven of cups, queen of pentacles, page of cups, six of pentacles, four of pentacles in reverse. And then we also have the hangman with the king of cups under the deck it was still kind of keeping going but like how many cards am i supposed to pull this person has a lot to say so what i got out of this was you know you're hanging somebody is somebody is hanging okay in some very confusing energy okay and they're they're a queen of pentacles so they're like you know a, a queen of pentacles they are <sighs> grounded stable reliable you know great kind of person so to keep them in this energy is kind of like shitty right so they're like you know this innocent love is coming and generosity is coming because this person is not attached to money maybe they have to like come to you like maybe they have to fly to you or they have to take a boat to you or they're not close to you so they're like you know this like it's confusing right now because you're planted and you can't go anywhere so this person's love this innocent love is going to move them because they're very generous and they're not holding on to anything because they're in a new phase so they're like you know just be strong like this it's gonna happen like this person's hanging in love for you they just don't it's they i guess they don't want to bombard you either with like all this love you know so they're just like I mean, this Cupid's arrow, maybe it hasn't hit them yet. Maybe this is, like, futuristic, you know? And, like, you're both going to get hit at the same time with this arrow. And, like, I believe this arrow exists. Okay? I really do. And I believe, you know, my ex has been coming into my dreams, like, a lot. And he comes in on his Harley every time. And I'm like, okay, I'll go hang out with you. But the thing is, I don't want to hang out with them. I don't. So, like, exes are coming back around, and when they get hit with that arrow, sometimes it's really hard for them to just walk away, you know? Like, when it hits, like, I believe this guy got hit with an arrow. I just took mine out. He hasn't taken his out yet, you know? Like, get over it. Um, Aquarius, 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 anything? This is, like, wow. Yeah. It's not going to get stolen from you. 
I gotta cut this ending because I can only record so long videos on my phone. So I have to cut this short. I don't really know how this is going to end. But nobody knows how anything is going to end. I know that somebody's going to have some big words to say when this arrow hits them. So your life might change, Aquarius. Get ready.